Good evening, Sean. Hello. How are you today? Good. How are you? I'm not too bad. I'm not too bad. Uh, are you feeling dwarf romantic? Damn straight. Okay, good. I Do you know what that means? I, you know, because... I uh, don't know what it means, no. What does no, it mean? Neither. I have no idea. Okay. Oh, God. Why no did idea. You, you... Oh, man. Right. Here we I go. Know. Dwarf. Yeah. Dwarf. Romantic. You Googling Dwarf it. romantic. Yeah. They should show me the game. Is it, yeah. does it translate something? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, so this is Dwarf Romantic from Tucana <laughs> Interactive. Um, a game that I've spotted people playing on my Steam uh, for a little while now. I, I also noticed that you've had clocked a, a few hours. With, with yeah, Dwarf. this has been my my weekend game. Like all my, my yeah German translation of romance possibly oh okay English I think it's yeah romance maybe yeah interesting hmm. romantic dwarves I'll go with that well that's Even that was dwarves. where my mind went to begin with it must be something to do with dwarves yeah right? yeah Even this dead. game is an absolute delight it, it it is isn't it and um yeah it's I'm just gonna dive in and just like yeah start, start. but it's 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 a simple delight isn't it it really is yeah. um mm -hmm. and it's how would you describe this game well would you want to describe this game or shall i this is a solitaire carcassonne okay it bold opening statements yeah end and end end <laughs> like, wow that's what this Just, game is and we'll stop. but it's a meditative like city build how would you describe it I, I actually found myself, because, again, Kath asked me and was yeah. like, what are you playing tonight? And I was like, right, okay. Uh, I found myself talking about it in, in very board game terms, I think was the yeah. way, mm -hmm. like, it's tile placement, right? And she was like, immediately yeah. she knew what that meant. And, yeah, uh, uh -huh. you know, and it it's it's super chilled, re relaxed. It's, it's it's like a kind of a city builder, but it's kind of not. Um, yeah. So, mm -hmm. you know... There's a lot going on. Oh, man. Right. So, like, what was that game we played that was super chill but didn't make me chill because of how all the metaphors were wrong? So, well, I was about to say, I didn't I didn't think it was the metaphors that would be, it but was quite the issue. I think it was my placement that got, like, our stream chat well, quite so agitated. Possibly, but your placement was was wrong because the metaphors were wrong. Okay. All right. And well, that's... Facing you know that's kind of you fault. to say yeah if it wasn't my fault but that was called islanders yes mm -hmm. and i did think like and hence my tweets and stuff uh for, for this game i did think like i think it's going to be super chilled out session but mm -hmm. if you're of a mind that like you're going to care where i put stuff then it might not be as chilled out as as it could be but I find this game, the way this game works, it encourages you to put things where they aesthetically make sense. Okay, yeah. And that's what I think is so genius. So do you want to explain those numbers? Well, I was actually going to say, do you want to explain those numbers? Okay, yes, yeah, 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 I'll explain the numbers. Okay. So so you, so you, basically you place tiles, but you have a limited number of tiles. The bottom right, you've got 36 tiles left at the moment. Yeah. To get more tiles, you need to complete the objectives that are appearing on the screen. Yep. So there was a plus two days about to for the forests or not forests uh, for the fields. So if there are now, is it four? That isn't the number of tiles, is it? What is that? What I'm not, I'm not sure if I ever figured out what that number refers to. I'm glad you said that. The, the number of fields, right? Well, I, I wasn't sure. Like, One, two, I three, don't four, know. Five. Yeah, because you, you need two and there's two fields on that tile you're about to place. Why do I need two? Is it's that a just a mini two. objective, right? Like that's the mini yeah, objective. The, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I did do and the then, tutorial, and I've done a mission mm -hmm. or a level, yeah. but that I wasn't quite as uh, mm -hmm. concrete on as I should have been. So there's a few little bits and pieces I'm not sure on mm -hmm. that we'll get to when we, when we. And it's that's 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 another reason why this game is delightful. It is deeper than you think when yeah. you first start. And and but also you can just enjoy placing tiles. Yeah. And it doesn't yeah. Matter too yeah, much, yeah. Right. Like. So um, let's, let's so, for the yeah. name of science then, if I place this, because that's turning yeah. from a plus two to a tick, let's see, I'm at 36 tiles at the moment. Mm -hmm. That gave me five, uh, four extra tiles. Or five. It did say five. plus five. So. 
but you placed a tile. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 it's 40. Is that 40 in your deck, not including the one that's currently in your hand? I think you're right, yeah. Maybe. Mm -hmm. So you get the number of tiles for the number of points for that one, right? Of that objective. (laughs) That's the number of points. But that was weird because it was plus... It was saying plus two, wasn't it? That's what... Yes, but originally it was plus five, but you you place those other ones it it's got the updated the number goes down as you add things and it's telling you how many you need to complete the objective right so this is saying like you need five trees yeah so if you yeah so if you put your that 13 that will go down to done i wish they're both because yeah, the that? number of trees oh, in that whole yes. group of trees now is equal to five plus it's thirteen. Not tiles, is it? Like no, that's it's what the my mind was trees. like. Number of trees. Mm. Number of trees, not tiles. Yeah. So that. So you got that nine. So to so do an experiment for me. Yeah. So the nine now, if you put. So this is where things are interesting. Well, I mean, it was already interesting, but put that nine. So that nine, if you put it next to the 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 fields where you've already scored points on. Okay. The yeah. ones that. The fields that you were used to score the last points don't count towards this one. But you had some left over because it was five. Right? I feel like I need a and graph are... or something. Mm-hmm. But it's very it's very it's very hard to explain um, with words, but it isn't that complex. Like it it's like you've used up You'd already marked off those tiles. It's like I'm trying to think like an area control game. You wouldn't be able to use the same area maybe twice. Yeah, but I'm trying to think of another example in board games where that's the case. So what's interesting is that like I can I can extend this forest right with more forests mm-hmm. with more trees. Yeah, but it, none of that numbers come up because for that tree I've hit the plus thirteen already. Right, whereas this yeah. is still going. Like I can still have this. This but that's but, yeah because you haven't because that was a nine yeah so you still need to con- make a total of nine and I so I um, don't want to connect like I guess and it fields by the looks of it, it doesn't matter if it's purple or yellow they now all I think there is something going on with that that I didn't quite read when I unlocked lavender because the the yes, it's purple lavender, ones are lavender yeah, yeah. I I I have I have an inkling. Mm. that if you match up the lavenders you get extra bonus points oh okay cool because there's also points which is different to tiles it's always Um, been surprises yeah so i don't what i'm thinking is i don't want to close this off like this is suggesting even though but it is open at this end right yeah and so it will tell you if you if you are if you this is a super clever design right Mm. if you place a tile that will mean that you can't complete an objective it will tell you There'll, there'll be a red X. Ah, uh, yeah. So mm-hmm. that means it is still possible for you to complete that objective. Yes. Yes, because this this field is open here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. And I'm looking also like I'm sure many of you at home have already noticed, but if you look at the at the stack of tiles, you do get a heads up of what's next, and yeah. also a mm-hmm. good indication of what the tile after that is going to be. So mm-hmm. I think if I place this here, I might be able to. Oh, it didn't quite work out, but it's okay. I thought that might bridge those two here, but it doesn't quite. Yeah, no. Yeah, it's a, yeah, because yeah. But here's that yeah, X so you're making saying. a farm exactly. Yeah. Like so, so yeah, Dave's off. Yeah, so it's encouraging you to make aesthetically pleasing maps. We'll 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 let we'll let everyone be the judge of that whether or not this ends yeah. up aesthetically uh-huh. pleasing. Um. Uh, yeah, like it, it's there's there's certainly benefits to that. But I uh, like, for instance, I placed that there that now, which is probably mm. inefficient because I've completed that. When you can still add another objective to that one at uh, some point in the future. Okay. Um, so like your big forest you're making down here, you might get another forest objective that you can add to it. Because um, tiles have separate objectives sometimes. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yes, because obviously, like. Like my natural inclination is massive forest. Let's build a massive yeah. forest. Why wouldn't you want to do that? But mm. so here's a housing objective. So, yeah, you've already got some houses up there you could connect yeah. to. On on the left, you've got yeah. a, a little like quite a few there. So if you yeah, if I, then you only need three. Okay. Yeah. 
and the choo choo train line yep and so the trains are interesting so like there's trains and um trains and rivers right yes yeah and they can uh, only be they can't be placed like going into like i can't flip yeah they they have more restrictions more you can't have adjacency like train restrictions yeah Okay, let's. What I really like, and some, so many of the systems are super smooth, but the way the tasks slightly change based on like what they're placed next to, like the water. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's a lovely touch. It's a lovely touch. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I find the rivers quite demanding, though. So I want yeah, to... the rivers are quite. Yeah, you have to think quite a way in advance. You've got another river coming up, mm -hmm. don't you? And also, okay, there's another thing. Do you, have you, so, oh, I, I wait until, actually, yeah, there's another thing. I'll wait until one shows up and I will. Do you know the other rule? The other rule. The other rule about getting points. Ah. Probably not. So, uh, you probably will if I, when you see it. Yeah, so. okay. Like, give me the benefit of the doubt. Mm -hmm. I appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah, so I, I've been, I don't know if I've been saying it on stream, but I like for the past few weeks, I've been struggling to find a game to kind of hold my attention mm. um, for various reasons. And this has done it. Like this is, it's just, it's just like, yeah. And it's a game I can play on the couch. Mm -hmm. I've, I've been playing it on my Steam link. I can play it together with Joe. We can sit and talk about it and but almost not talk about it, just kind of like we're both just watching and being I was like, going to say, do you think it yeah. is a game that encourages that kind of conversation then? Because that, that, that's interesting. Like, mm -hmm. I wasn't sure if it did. Yeah. Um. Well, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, yeah, yes, I, I, I think so. Okay. Cool. Like, cause you, because you've got that thing where you see the, so Joe was keeping a more eye on like what was coming up next. Mm -hmm. Whereas I wasn't really thinking that far ahead. Um, oh, it's plus. This is plus six, yeah. But if you put it on the left, that... so the other thing is like you're thinking, I'm thinking like your forest, you've got forests, like where could that forest extend to another forest? Mm -hmm. So I try and get get them so that you're kind of preparing for things future. Mm -hmm. Because when you run out of cards, so when you run out of cards, that's it. Yes, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I think that's the thing. So, Dave, yeah, Dave was saying, like, punishment for failure. And it seems calm and aesthetic when you first start. And it is. But it is, like, it gets to the point where I've I've got to the point, I've got to the bit where I am actually starting to think about, you get that thing that you get in board games where you know you're about to, so, you know that, that point in a board game where you know someone's about to win or you're about to lose. Mm. And so you're like, I know I've got one turn left what's the most optimum way i can use my turn yeah and it's like that it's like oh i've got three cards left and these are the objectives i've got suddenly i'm thinking about like you know you really need to get those you know like those objectives are like if you want to get a good score like you really need to keep them going you know like mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you're in a bit of a spot here because you've got your objectives are those train lines but the water this water will help you Oh yes, yeah. Well, I th yeah. but those things like there's nothing I can do about those until no, no. the train comes mm -hmm. up, right? As long as I just yeah. The, the important thing is not to hem them in, right? Like to give them as much mm -hmm. space as possible. I think. Yeah. Um, it's also worth mentioning as well. You unlock new cards as you, so that in the top right hand corner you can see there's three circles. Yes. Um, and those are basically counting achievements. And yep. when you unlock those, you get a new card that gets added on your next playthrough, or possibly on the same playthrough. It, um, yeah, I was really interested that that like carries through all the mm -hmm. way, like because I'm on champion, I'm on landscaper two now because I did yeah. landscaper one on the previous map or yeah. previous mm -hmm. deck run through. So this is an interesting one. You got an X. Yeah. So like, why? So so why is that giving you some? This is where I sometimes get confused because I can't tell why that like i can't quite figure out in my head why that's not possible yeah why placing that there would be a bad thing 
and I don't know if it's got has it I wonder sometimes I wonder if it's got something to do with um you've already used objectives on those and you haven't done oh maybe no I didn't no but I didn't yeah yeah but hmm. like I do sometimes yeah I don't or if like Joe was thinking maybe there's no tiles in the deck that would help you complete that is the it big... actually should look doing that far advanced or but but this, I don't see how that would. Yeah, but this isn't this like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's ten houses here yeah. already. So like, mm -hmm. maybe that's it, it because you can't you can't place an objective where there where in a way that or automatically does it for you. You can. I, I so I've done that before. Oh, okay. Yeah. I want like I I did wonder if this is an early access game. I wondered if there's a few times where I'm like, oh, is that a bug? Mm. Mm hmm. Um, <clears throat> which Should is that I thing you try it for science? Could do. Um, so, okay. Yeah, the objectives are in the deck, and yeah, yeah, that didn't do anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's that's a no go. Even if it is a bug, it's a no go. Yeah. So the um yeah, when the so with your objective, it's the objective is always at one of the specific things on a tile. So even though the tile had houses and forest, the objective is just for the was just for the houses then. Um hi Nacho, yeah. we're good. Evening, How are Nacho. You? Oh you can't place it there. No. Huh. Yeah, it's really tough. Like this is a bad train. You can't tile. you don't want to place it near there, right? Well like just, uh, but it's either yeah it's kind of not i don't want it too far away though right like i think here would probably yeah or like this is too i mean there's no there's no tiles no no, no you like, could get there's there's a bunch of down there like yeah. um yeah that because you get a straight train to mm -hmm. a couple of straight ones down there mm -hmm. i mean this yeah. is a long field here it is a big field. I think, yeah, Dave stuff's right. It's a, it's a, it's a deck game. It's a board game, but the board is the deck. Yeah. So okay, so so there you see it's now that's a so the tree ones are always scary. It's one hundred and ten yeah. trees, but you've already got that takes it down to nineteen immediately. Yeah, yeah. Um. The only issue is you're seeing water there. Can you cut my bottling in? But like. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's still definitely the best one to, to maximize yeah. my chance of actually doing this. Well, and so, but this is where it's interesting because, like, is it what about long term? Is that a good idea? Mm. The north and east forest could connect. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think building up here is probably safer. Just Ooh, because of the train. yeah, yeah, that yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's your train thingy. Would you? Continuing the massive fields. That is, yeah. It but needs then, three more, interestingly. Yeah, because, yeah. So that because you've already done a bunch of objectives on those fields. There's also a thing about like capping things off, like isn't there? Because if you like, yeah, you. That was the thing that hasn't yeah. turned up. That I was gonna. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. Go on, Johnny. No, no, no. You go. You right. go. Um. So what will happen every so often, and. It, I, sometimes I miss it. It's not obvious. So you, you might sometimes I, I have a, a quick look at zoom out and look at the board to see if it's there. Um, is sometimes a flag will show up on an area like a forest. And that's an objective where what the game wants you to do is, like Dave said, cap it off and make sure that that forest can no longer be extended so that you can't just so it discourages this this massive field mm -hmm. right because mm -hmm. if it randomly tells you you've got to close this field that's going to take you ages but that's one of your objectives of how you get new cards so that like, you get new cards with that as well so it is as important as doing these numbers so it kind of balances that problem i, I guess that's why that's there is to balance that problem of why wouldn't you just make or put all your tiles together mm. you know mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. um So Dave, uh, Dave was, was going to recommend Train Fever. Um, 
yeah so like, i i do want to is tra train fever is the 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 basically like really fundamental like it's like distilled transport tycoon but like in a little tiny diorama is that the one where you build trains in a very small area oh nice two two ticks two ticks Oh, it's tr I think maybe I'm thinking of something different. Is there anything you can do with the trains that are moving? Uh... Like, it's got that objective on it. But it's still, like, there's nothing, like, you couldn't. No. Doesn't seem to be. No, I mean, like, I, I wonder if, like, it can, you can build, um, like, you know, you'd be able to build tr track to kind of make it go somewhere, right? Where do you want to go, Sean? I don't know. Anywhere, really. Like. Ooh, okay, 32. This is good. Surely this. <laughs> surely we've uh, almost got this sorted. Yeah. That is a field. Why is that a field? Ooh, la la. Right, another train one. I'm going to add train fever to my wish list. Um... I'm still doing my uh, dive on Steam and letting the algorithm take me. Nice. Um, which has been good. Like, my wish list has grown. My My wallet has shrunk. <laughs> Yeah, funny. Oh, this looks nice. Is it? Oh, uh, you mean the game? Train Fever. Yeah. Yeah. You, uh, what's the name for your for your town? For my town. Yeah. What's this town called? Dave's Mess. Okay. Were they both plus 41 there? Or one's 45, the one's 41. Ah, okay. Not a lot in it, yeah. So deep. This train track is killing me. Well, you, oh yeah, yeah, you keep... But at this point, you're just going to join it the other way, right? <laughs> yeah, we Where have, we, yeah. There we go, but that's like... Another objective. Mm -hmm. This river also probably isn't going anywhere, but there we go. No, Dave Soft. It just very quickly went down to the passing to the, to the roundabout thing. Yeah, it must it must track them for the objectives that you've already done then, right? Like you're saying, because yeah, yeah, I think that is what it is. But I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it is. Yeah, like once you've used a thing in an objective, it mm -hmm. must get like ticked off internally. Mm -hmm. um, I was about to say it'd be nice to have some kind of UI to show that, but actually, that would be against the aesthetic, right? Like mm -hmm. the, the whole point of this game is it's not like that. I suppose it's just some. Oh, Dave! Top left, top left, top left. Did you see that? What? Scroll out to the left, out into the beyond. Oh! Yeah. Uh -huh. I haven't seen uh -huh. that before. Yeah. Oh, gosh, yes. Mystery. I, I have to place this tile here. But yes, I will be. Mm -hmm. And I have to place this one here. Yay! Water, tra water train station. All aboard the nice. water train. Oh, the water. So. They're, they're they're pretty cool. They're like mm -hmm. ends of trains. Nice. 
so you can end the the and you can end it with water, which probably would help you down there. And you've got <laughs> one coming up in one, two, three oh, that's tiles. That's true. Right? Good call. Good call. Good call. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, you know where you're going to put your field. You, you... <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're we're going out this way as well. It's okay. like, yeah. I'm surprised there's been no flags yet. That's true. That's true. I haven't seen a single flag yet. I'm getting that. Right, so this thing you think somewhere down here? I think so. It'll end your you can end your train with it, but and you can bring in like the track from multiple directions. Okay. So we but, probably I mean, you want know, it you could there. possibly. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. This is my field of dreams. If you build it, they will come up here. I think, yeah. Can can we make an AI to play this? That's the question. <laughs> I mean that you know is is that is that a fun question? Fun question. Oh, Dave's are suggesting so. tall assisted speed runs. So. Oh okay yeah. yeah. So the inputs of the AI would be the current board state, <laughs> the objectives, um, I love that you're already and the next, three the next three tiles in order. I wonder if you could, if you, maybe you could write one, like, could you write an, I get, yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Feel pretty pretty confident saying I couldn't write one. But mm -hmm. That's not really what you're. Oh asking. yeah, the tiles. Yeah, they're different. Yeah, you're right. Um. Why can't I put that there? You see, this is yeah. Okay, so I this is where I've I've had issues where I don't understand. Like, I don't know if there's some kind of limit to the number of points you can get in one space. This just makes me think you can't put it somewhere that you've already got you've already got the scoring number of water basically. Or maybe it's because have you got exactly the right number of Oh, cuz it's loads. It's loads more than 6, isn't it? Yeah, but you've have you used all those exactly for objectives? May maybe. Yeah, maybe. Maybe that's it. Um Where do you want to put it? Uh, or there. I'm pretty sure people have have made like Carcassonne bots and stuff. Well, there's a there's a game. There's like a computer game, so probably. Oh, I, I should have looked. So, could you then join that one up to your other one? Well, that's. And what happens to the objective there? Well, yeah, quite, quite. We're gonna try. We're gonna try. I don't know if I'll be able to because it's like pretty wonky, but. The thing I love about this and, and is that it is just the right amount of like you it, it engages just the right amount of your kind of game playing brain. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But not so much that it's not welcome. Yes. Like it, it, you know, any more and it would be too much. <laughs> and it would lose that kind of that that meditative just chilling that just, that kind of chill. Mm. Or oh, you've got another end of a a train, yeah, that's that's what's like. Oh, that's that's an important piece. Mm -hmm. I want to risk putting it here. Maybe here. Yeah, we want to do this with a chess timer. Like, I want some <laughs> kind of multiplayer. Like, yeah, like. 
Oh. If there's a way of having the same seed and, and us both play this at the same time. That field, man. If you're going to have to close that off. Yeah, I'm never good. closing this off. I'm never closing it. I've got time. You've got to get to that thing. I know, I know, I know. I'm on it. I just want to use a useless tile. Oh, 48 houses. Wow. Okay, cool. Oh, what's the... There's like a little crown on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So super duper... Um, Probably get something pretty cool for that. Okay. But you can join those houses. You can get pretty close to the one... I think so. Those houses you just built. Yeah, yeah. I need any more trees? Have you got any tree? You've got tree executive somewhere, haven't you? Yeah, that's why I've just... Uh, yeah. Great mind, Sean. Wow, 48 houses. Should we, should we, like, double down on this? Like, Yeah, double down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's build a city over here. Yeah. You see, that... I, I don't understand. Now I've got some flags. Wait. Where have you got flags? Yeah, on this forest. <laughs> Explain yeah. those flags then. So you get better. I think the idea. So when you hover over a flag, you can see if I zoom in a little bit more, um, or am I max zoom in? No, yeah. Okay. So you can see like those hex uh, edges glow green. So I have to close those hexes off to get that bonus, right? Yeah, that and that's right? extra cards. Yeah, and that's extra mm -hmm. cards, right? So. The interesting thing is, if I'm right, Sean, I don't have to close them off with forest, or do no, I? No, 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 you so. don't. You you can. It's yeah. It's about making it so you can't possibly extend it anymore. Mm -hmm. Um, I mean, ideally, which, you want to close it off with forest, right? Like, like ideally. Yeah. That, so you get bonus. So I don't know if you've noticed. There's almost like a trick store, trick score element going on as well. Have you noticed that pop up? Uh, no. Well, maybe, you get, but like, not realize that. Was what and it was, yeah. you get combos and rewards for whether or not your 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 kind of things are are, are perfect. Mm. So I think perfect is when you you've you've created tiles with like. So you got a plus ten for placing that, mm -hmm. but you'd get like perfect if you closed off something uh, perfectly, 20, or like yeah, yeah, yeah. so. For example, those like your fields to your left of the flag. Mm. Those are not perfect because they're cut off fields. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They're not complete. Whereas if you have a complete, it's matching. You get bonus points for matching things. Sure. That's an interesting tile. Yeah, yeah. It's, um, you I'm put it down on it. Mm. Struggling to use it, ideally. Probably really balls this tile up. Uh, okay. Move on, move on. Yeah, I, li I like classic tile game for me is like, I always find myself in situations where I'm like, I've lived, given myself something really specific I need here, and that's never a good thing. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah, Dave's also good. But yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's like, yeah, it's, it's, is it area control? It's not area control. Is area control the right way of saying it? I don't think so, because area control is often about, um, like, like almost being aggressive. Often mm -hmm. you're controlling it so that other people don't, which is not quite mm -hmm. what's going on here. Yeah, it's it's the, and I think what's really clever about the flag system is that it it counters that. Just extending, mm -hmm. expanding regions. Oh no, you're right. So so you have to cap the forest. That's the thing. Because yeah, yeah. You've just extended. Yeah, yeah. I've so you've that, extended yeah. that. Mm -hmm. You've not made it worse, but you've not made it better. So, yeah. Ah, yeah, he 
test. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's good. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And that uh -huh. works now for your objective. But yeah. it makes it so you can't get... That one. I don't understand. But, uh, that makes no sense to me. Because does that mean if I collect, connect these... Can you not have two... No, you can clearly have two ongoing objectives. Yeah. I don't get why... So, well, that just means I'm going to definitely place it here. We'll see how that goes. But yeah. It is a bit odd. Right. So it's, once... Yeah, it's... it's. I, I don't... Yeah. What I haven't worked out and is do the objectives get more challenging as the game progresses? And also, I'd be interested to... Oh, there you go. Fix that problem. Yeah. Um. Maybe create others. Who knows? Yeah, I'd be interested to know, mm. like, if those objectives are dynamic or in the deck already. Okay. Mm -hmm. You see what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, I was trying to figure out when I was playing, like, how many objectives, what's the most number of objectives I had on the board at any one time? Um, mm. Mm hmm. Yeah, the flags do do tend to be reactive. I, I think. You don't get many house tiles. I really they? not, am I? I? These seem like completely, like, well beyond my ability at this point. You are your tiles. Twenty two tiles. It's getting. You know. You... Don't worry. Oh, that's a big. You've got lots of houses there. That would close it, yeah. wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. I think yeah, that so. Yeah, yeah. That. This, this train. See, this is where you kind of start questioning: like, should you actually put use should, for the sake of your deck? Should you use that card there with your train track thing? Mm. Do you just want to use that to try and close off your forest so you can get the extra cards? Yeah, pro yeah, probably. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. I won't get any star points for it. Well, you will because over because it's it's actually this is what it's helping you. Like, it's making it like you will have a forest that is standalone. Yeah. And look, that that's perfect. Train to go up there. That will cut the forest off because it's like the train goes through it. Yes, but it's twenty four, like oh, yeah, that's objective true. on its own. So really, mm. I want it to link it up with my my mm. existing train line, right? <laughs> Good luck with that. <laughs> Like, I suppose that, hmm. It's I do a... like it how you've got this massive train system that just seems to serve, like, two very small houses. <laughs> that, yeah, it's, it's for commuters. Don't worry about it. Okay. That's a very specific tile I'll be looking for if I put it there. This is what I'm already looking for anyway, I suppose. That's the thing. There's no way I can get 24 up there with this many stars. So it has to be Wait. here. This is what we're hoping for. But there's no way you're going to get it there either. Oh, look at this. <laughs> tick, tick, tick. I don't know what that two. Oh, well, oh, how did that? But it's making the X that two. You're yeah, I don't, what... I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. But I get. I get. What tick... if you put the. Instead of joining them, what happened? Like. I don't know why. I don't know. I don't know why that's <laughs> not working. But I, I'm willing to sacrifice it, I think, at this stage, right? Mm. The two ticks and a cross. Yeah. It's all right. Oh, hmm. No, I don't understand. Yeah, I just don't. That's one thing I don't understand. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. I think Dave's stuff might be onto something. Oh, yeah. Is that each river, river section can only be used by one objective, but that isn't determined yet because there's like the game is deciding which of those to be used. 
Okay. If so, you close the loop which doomed it, but if you went the other way, they'd both be open but incomplete. Okay. I did those both those flags, by the way. Cool. Could you get cards for that? I think I must have, because I'm now on 37, which is much more than I yeah. was. Mm -hmm. Oh, that train line. It's 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 a work of Escher level art at this stage. Mm -hmm. Like it's really really something. Really coming together. I wouldn't okay. <laughs> no. No, it wouldn't, John. Uh, Make it go towards the river. It's, it's not what I'd have done. Yeah, I know. I know. But don't worry. You need houses. Oh, you got some houses coming up. Perfect. You see that? Perfect. There you go. So you got that's. Why? Is... So yeah, I don't quite understand where the perfect comes from. Just um... pure. Well, you, you wouldn't understand perfection, Sean. It's fine. Don't worry about mm -hmm. it. It's just one of those things you've either got or you don't. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna join. There's part two. of me that like wants to look up all these rules, but the other part of me is like, no, that's no. Yeah, you'd lose out. The on joy the is not knowing. Yeah. So I don't have any flags at the moment. Nothing like that to to sort out. So no. See, look. Totally fine. Just a bend in the, uh, just the old bend round yeah. in the old uh, train stakes. Oh, it's got an end of a. Oh, I almost missed that. It's got the end of a railway line. Oh yeah! Wow. Yeah. No, I didn't. Okay. Can you? So, does that help you at all? I mean, it could, or it could cause problems, right? Like if I end this line here, and for mm. some reason I can't, for some reason I can't connect this weird junctiony bit, then you're screwed. Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't do it. like. But if you use those houses, which is probably what you're in more desperate need to, yeah. you've still got the train line at the top. Yeah. Yeah, like two different two different stations. Like, I, there are bonuses. There are a lot. There are bonuses for like really. Um, there's like achievements that unlock new new stuff. Um, you see, how is that an X? I, do, I, like, I, I don't know. know. Like that. The, there's no way you've used all those. Or, or it's just like it's been they've been scored too many times, maybe. I think it must be. I feel like that's something that needs explaining sometimes. Mm -hmm. Like, like why, like. It would certainly like like feed into that whole they don't want you to just build one big thing of the same thing mm. over and over again, right? Yeah, so like Dave's are saying that it's, yeah, it's 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 almost like they're not giving you the warning or the flag or it's um yeah I don't know I can't remember it in the tutorial that's the thing no I can't either. Doesn't give me a lot of options after. Have you got any open? Uh, well, yeah, I think that's probably yeah. It's, it's it's. I think it's open at this end. Probably. I think you're doing pretty well. Thanks, dude. I'm trying to think what my high score is. I don't know if there's like a friends leaderboard or anything. Um.
so I started playing um, not Roller Coaster Tycoon, but the new one. Oh, I thought pla- what, what's was it, it called? Planet Planet Coaster. Planet Coaster. Who's, who's yeah. Planet Coaster. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How was that? It's good. It. it it's good. Uh-huh. But. But. Um. But. It's a big but. Yeah. What like. And I think the butt is my problem rather than the game's problem. It's your butt. Your butt's the problem. Yeah, like, I just want to make big roller coasters and I make them and, like, <laughs> the people are too lie. scared to go on it. Oh, I see. And so, like, you know. But but then it is kind of fun then kind of going back and thinking, right, how can I make this so people actually don't, like, throw up or, or like, faint or whatever. Mm. Um. But the it's it's really strange. So here's my problem with it: is the game. If I play on sandbox mode, it's mm-hmm. just I've just got too much choice, and it unlocks everything, and um, like I just I just feel lost, or like mm-hmm. I'm not slowly unlocking things, and it, I feel like that's what I want. Yet if I play in the kind of more career focused modes where there's an economy, the game is brutal. And you lose money for like undoing things. You don't get the cost back of what you did. So if I screw up a, if I'm building a roller coaster and screw something up, mm. that's sunk cost. Oh, look at this piece. Look at this piece, Sean. Check it out. Nice. Train station. Sorry. Yeah. So, so yeah. Okay. Sunk. Some. You said something about sunk costs, and I, I then stopped listening. So, characters, just recap. <laughs> Uh, recap. Um, yeah, when you build roller coasters and you make mistakes, you lose the money. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And you want too much roller coasters. You're just trying to big, build too big. Yeah. As if Jurassic like, Park has, has taught you nothing. That Jurassic Park is by the same people. Ah, oh, okay. But I think as like the zoo type, the, mm-hmm. the planet zoo or whatever. See, look, look, that, 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 so this one over here. That worked. This one down here said, no, you can't use your massive thing. Yeah. These two, totally fine with it. What's the branch on? What does it, want? What does it mean? Well, you've got a 30 plus 30. Can you do that on the. Oh, plus six. Yeah, we, are, we, are, we, are, we are able to do it. I want to use the trees, though. That's, that's my. That's the thing. I've got a big tree. Project two hundred and five trees to build over here. Mm-hmm. It's, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot building into over there. I think maybe Valheim spoiled me with the fact that you can just demolish stuff and get all your money back. Oh yeah, fair. Interestingly, I've stopped playing Valheim. Yeah. Yeah. Um, me and my friend, we got we we did the penultimate boss. Or like what appears to be the penultimate boss, and then we're like, I don't think we can be bothered to grind all the stuff we think yeah. we need for the mm-hmm. next one, so we're just gonna yeah. kind of not do it anymore. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, that's but that's okay. Good. I mean, you got a lot of time out of that game, right? Oh yeah, like yeah, that game owes us nothing. That's mm-hmm. for sure. Yeah. So you playing anything else now? Um. Yeah, oh yeah, we started, um, like, can you remember ages and ages ago, I think I was talking to you about um, the uh, Battlefleet Gothic Armada 2. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, thing, yeah, yeah. Right, and I was like, I, like, this just seems really hard for me to get into. I don't, I want yeah. to, but like, I'm struggling and blah, blah, blah. And uh, yeah, so I was just like, with my friend, I was like, I want to, I want to like this game. It's got a co-op mm-hmm. campaign mode. Mm-hmm. Can we just try it? And yeah. you know, if you hate it, fine. But like, I just need some help getting into it. And actually, yeah, that's exactly what happened. So we've we've only done one session of it so far, mm-hmm. but so far enjoying it. Cool. I very nearly picked that up on the weekend. Ah, okay. In my in my Steam thingy, what's it? Mm-hmm. It does look good. Something interestingly. So so something interesting about I found the. The total, like, 
I'm not sure if it's Sega or the Warhammer games. So what did you get? Oh, did you? Oh, uh, so I just unlocked oh. the village thing, but oh, you unlocked a challenge. Yeah, but I think that's up here, isn't it? Rather than oh no, mm. no. So th that's now available, maybe. So that maybe then you can get something with that challenge. So you found, <laughs> you found the tile, and then you unlocked the challenge to then unlock it. Yeah, I think so. Mm. So. As the more I've been kind of exploring Steam, the more I've been getting frustrated with trailers that that don't. I don't understand why you can't get why yeah. why that ripper is giving you like that. It's like it, I can't put it anywhere, like nowhere. Mm. With, it just won't play nice with anyone. Yeah, is it to do with it? Does I wonder? Do you know mm. what I think it might be? Go on. Is it to do with it? The game knows what cards are left in the deck, and because there's only twenty cards, it's happening to you. Because if you place it there, there aren't cards in the deck for you to actually get it there. Ah, uh, okay. But, but this, is, this is way more than seven connected water bits, though, right? Or but maybe, you've maybe not. Them maybe off for the challenge. Yeah. yeah, true, true, true. Yeah. So you We're... can place that challenge. So you can place it in a fresh spot and hope you get tiles that can work it. Yeah. Okay, Whereas let's if try you that. Do it now, it's definitely a fail right now. But then you'd think if it's to do with the tiles that you've got, it wouldn't just it would just like be like, wow, wow, you can't do this one. No, because it because you might get tiles in the meantime that means you can do it. But then why tell me that I can't at all if you're if you're going by you that? You definitely logic? can't if you because the game knows you definitely can't in that other situation. No, but but if the game's always saying, "Oh, I might give you more tiles," yeah, then there's no point where it's going to be like, "Oh, you know, don't worry about it, buddy. Like, you're never going to be able to do this because it's always saying you might get more tiles." I don't know. I really want to connect this, but it's definitely the wrong thing to do because I've got a flag there. Um. So Dave's just saying, assume the challenge tiles are about making new things. So place the challenge river in a fresh spot. So if it wants a new lake, but an extension to the existing lake. But sometimes it's okay with it. Yeah, that's yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? Which like, is the weird thing. Sometimes it's like, it's all, it's all good. Every time I think I understand what's going on with that rule, which kind of almost makes me think it might be a bug. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Are you, are you, you're close to that. If I only know, you've got another. Mm -hmm. So build, but definitely. Mm. Okay, we're putting out. Oh, no, that's a terrible idea, Dave. Sean, why did you, you let didn't. me do that? No, why, did you do that? <laughs> why did you let me do that, Sean? <laughs> that the... that, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Don't panic, everyone. Yeah. We're going to be fine. going to be fine. Has that saved you, that tile? No. No. No, 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 there's no tile. saving me from this tile. Don't worry, don't worry. We're just going in a slightly different direction. It's fine. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I can do this. Yeah, there we go. But it is, yeah, like like you're Ooh. already getting a nice aesthetic to, you know, oh, you've got a skin. Skin. A different colored train. In a, uh, That's definitely what we wanted. They... going to be putting in romantic bucks or whatever <laughs> so why does so, that okay what happens that? is this I don't, know, I don't know i don't know i don't like this just just yeah okay this could go here like that's that's good news that's fine but this that's split by the lake yeah no but that's because it's not touching the seven no that's not connected so that makes sense <laughs> sort of um so this can't go here Go here, go down here. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. That's what we needed. Yeah. I think. See, look, yeah, like I can't. I can't I, oh, God. Yeah, it's, it must be because something to do with. I, or is it having the same. Are there certain tiles that there's already a river? There's already a there. river objective. I've been no, no, there's already a boat. Oh, okay, maybe. Can you have two boats? Or the north. So, yeah, Dave's just like, we need water in the north. He has it. He has got a point. I don't know. This is the boating district. <laughs> Yeah. What's weird? Okay, what is super weird, right? Here, no. Here, fine. Right? It's weird because that's connected to the that's the other tile that's connected to a completely different river. True. This is now connected to the rest of that river. But that just makes me think if I could, if I put this here and then I do connect it all up, it's not going to work at all. Yeah, you're probably right. It must be that boat thing that, that those objectives can't be. Well, guess what? I made a river here, so it's going there. Now. So... so there's that. Right, I need trees down here. I've been neglecting my tree duty. Mm -hmm. Should we do? Oh, you've only got nine towers left, Dave. Yeah, we're reaching the end. I don't see how... I've got a few objectives ongoing. Can you quickly close off that village at the top? Or is that going to just cost too many tiles to do? I mean, like, where you're not... when you Where you can't use a tile to actually complete an objective, you might as well try and close that off. That's true. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's good thinking. It's a lot. It's going to take a lot, but we can do it. Yeah, less than nine tiles, so... But you can then use that to finish off some of those, maybe. Why is that? Why and then you got that? another one. That one only needs one. How? What? 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 <laughs> what? What is it not happy with, Sean? Riddle Why me this. Do I have to only use one? No, 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 <laughs> no, no. So it's got to be up here, like because. Huh. I think it's got to be two of the tiles you've got left, right? Oh, that'll do it. Uh, done. Yeah, we did that. Nice. Oof. We only got one tile for that. Let's cap this, mate. Oh, no, do we, we we definitely want to cap this one. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. well yes, that one we do. Edge usage, as in. Edges can be used by one objective. So I don't have any other flags. No. But you you've got some um Right. What's this? It's a do you note. think it's something like that? Like, it's like so Dave was saying it's to do with the edges, potentially. And that each objective... So each objective has to be... Oh, shit! It is, isn't it? What? That's exactly what it is. Each objective has to be contained within a single area touching. So there what? might be some weird case that you can't... Like, a farm... Like, it's saying you need to have a continuous set of fields that are 15 of them in a lump together, right? But because yeah. those eight are there, mm -hmm. like, if you put those two there, like, it's, it's almost impossible to, like, visualize. I'm certainly struggling. It just means that... What? I'm certainly struggling. You, yeah. Okay, don't. Yes, don't yeah, put, yeah, yeah. So don't put objectives. That's the, yeah. But that, what's okay. weird then is like, why is this totally fine? Like, why is this looking at gravy up here? Because it because you can fit those two areas whole. So like those areas 
like you can tessellate the I, however much those were originally yeah there there's still room to go like this it still will be possible there's a tile that will make that thing down there possible mm. but you just don't have that tile because otherwise it would be saying it's not possible what 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 tile is that it's like... probably like all fields it's probably like a tile that's all just fields uh, okay yeah mm -hmm. Well, we learned something. I feel like <laughs> I, I feel that's... like my brain has is 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 maybe expanded or, or so like the rivers. Okay, it's probably easier to describe with the rivers because yeah, that that might be easier to make sure we're right. So if we go, you know, you're having the issues with those rivers down yeah. there. It's because you haven't got two rivers of seven length that can sit next to each other. You might have like you or however many different. So if you put the six next to the seven, mm. you won't be able to fit two sevens and a six in that one stretch. Uh, okay, I I mm -hmm. think I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah, that like your yeah. But doesn't that like presuppose I won't be branching off it, right? But then I well I, I don't know. I like, think maybe it's closer there is... to something like Dave's what Dave's suggesting about like. The boats not playing well together. Although these two, look at these two down here. Mm -hmm. They seem okay. Yeah. I feel like that's something that pos if that if it is the area thing, which kind of makes sense. There needs to. Be, I feel like some UI to that effect would be quite so, good. So what? So that, that works, yeah. So that works, like because that's just one. Yeah. And and you've added it down there in a different place to where it was. But why did like Whereas when, when I you added had the other more one more fields? When you added the more fields, it was probably adding the two because the one you had before was like two fields and then one big one. And and what the game was probably doing was adding those two little fields to the seven, yeah. which meant the one that needed the one behind it couldn't. It wasn't the one that was left over wasn't connected. Yeah. Does that kind of make sense? I, th I mean, f for someone more intelligent than me, probably yes. But like that was. So it encourage. So it does kind of discourage those massive mega farms even though you've done quite well with that one massive mega farm yeah well i'm certainly not i'm certainly spreading my objectives out just to, just to ease my brain right. I, I probably bulls but also out. yeah there, there is something to do with purple as well possibly all right i'm capping this i'm capping this line there we go we're done with this line now. yeah 15 left here. 15 left dave 15. And you've got a flag to cap off. I do, but it, those in, field. it involves, like, I've got very few fields left, so I will lose this objective. So that's my that's my last, like, gasp, like, if I have to do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you see how this game has, how this ch it's changed. Though, as we've been playing this, now you're at mm. this stage in the game, you know, yeah. Yeah. And yes, Dave, that's right. The preview doesn't let you know if it's an objective, so you can't plan ahead for obje objectives, which is an interesting choice. Mm -hmm. It's it's this such a good game. I I yeah, like it's so much better than that. I thought it was going to be this nice, just relaxed. <laughs> I didn't even realize there was much of a game to it, and it is relaxed. Like yeah, but also. It's super interesting, mm -hmm. and there you got a perfect. I did. It was quite satisfying. I find it doesn't necessarily encourage you, or I haven't found a way it encourages you to fill holes. No. Well, I think it is that perfect side of things. Like, that seems to be where mm -hmm. I'm getting them quite with some regularity. You closed those did, all yeah. off, didn't you? Yeah. Um, yeah. So that's one you've already used an objective on, which is why it's not mm -hmm. liking it. Because it can't fit enough. 
So you might be better off starting. Oh, that one you haven't right used down, objective yeah, on. Yeah. That makes sense. So I was going to tell you about what's been annoying me about these. Um, I think the worst culprit is the Total War games for sure. Oh, right? what, sorry, on yeah. their store pages, mm -hmm. no, I, I shall I shall leave people to go and look at this. Uh -huh. Find gameplay on the Steam store pages for the Total War games. But the Warhammer ones, or just in general? All of them. They're in general. Also. I found some of the Warhammer games are like this as well. So um, Gothic Fleet Armada is, mm -hmm. is guilty of this. Mm -hmm. Is you, you, your struggle to find it. Like it just, it's everything but the gameplay. Like the trailers are just all cinematic. Cinematic. And stuff, and it, yeah. yeah. And it, in particular, I, I was looking at the Gothic Armada one and I, and I wanted to, even though I played the first one, I was like, oh, well, how's the gameplay look in this one? Or, mm -hmm. you know, what's the what's it like actually doing the kind of naval stuff? Sure. But I couldn't find any UI. It was all, like, I guess replays. Because there was no UI or anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Yeah, we, we, we're keeping this train. Oh, you got three. Oh, no, okay. You, yeah, mm-hmm. I'm going to quickly go grab a glass of water. All right, buddy. I think we're going to have to forego that to get that one. Tiles. Yeah, that's a good call there, uh, Mr. J, about just watching Twitch. I think I think Sean's right, but it, it, it I guess also like the fact that like a lot of store pages these days have like broad live broadcasts a lot of the time as well. So, um. You know, maybe they're just deciding that actually, like, gameplay is not quite as much uh, important. But I don't know. I ha I on honestly hadn't noticed that, um, but I think it's a really interesting point. Um, Sean raises about gameplay, trailers, and such. Because that's obviously something, like, we as... Indie developers are very, very much concerned with making sure we get the right kind of trailer on our store and people just seem to want gameplay and then you see these big companies not doing it. It's kind of interesting. Well, I guess the big companies can kind of get away with it. Yeah, that might also like be we always like, say. Yeah, yeah. But like it that that sometimes feels like an easy excuse. Mm -hmm. Or an e e like an easy thing to just like, Well, and, and, and I didn't buy that game because of it you know like i didn't buy um what should i call it armada e2 armada e2 electric boogaloo yeah dave have you told someone about our cycle 28 anime i thought no <laughs> one was meant to know about that God, well you try keeping something from dave soft he's like he's like i don't know he knows more about pillbug stuff than i do most of the time I still can't. I still am not entirely sure if co-op and making a home was our idea or his idea. Pretty sure it was his idea. Um, I mean, just the, my biggest worry is the cotton's on and it, it starts to like demand salary or something. That's my real yeah. worry. <laughs> uh, yeah. 
Oh, look at those tiles. We're cooking on gas well, it, now. It, 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 well, well, you still haven't cottoned on and demanded a salary yet, so I think you're okay. <laughs> that's, a, that's a really good point. That's a good point. Yeah. Well, oh. enough, enough about that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, it's oh. funny because it's painful. Yeah. Wow, nine, 93 fields. Yeah. Are they are these getting more challenging as we go? The numbers that have got bigger, definitely. Yeah. Oh, that I'm, that one. I'm really glad the that? super farm is right. fine. Do you know what? All this stuff we've been yeah. talking about, how we think we understand it. I don't think that, we do. Is, is that There's gone no out way, the window now? No way. That went out the window with that uh, 93 okay. that just worked. Cool. Great. Like, no way that it's what we thought. Right? Well, I don't know. I didn't really understand what you were talking about anyway, so... Mm -hmm. hmm. So we've got any voice actors in, in place for this anime yet? <laughs> yeah, who would you cast in a Cycle 28 anime? Oh, God, I don't know. Well, Kath, presumably, is <laughs> no, the voice of... I think what we've established is that Kath cannot voice act, and, and uh, that's why we don't have voice acting in Cycle 28. Mm -hmm. I keep... I know I, I say this a lot, mm -hmm. but whatever. Um, making a trailer for Cycle 28 was super hard, and I, and I still think it's a really hard game to make a trailer for. Mm -hmm. And I... And I and the more I, I think about it, or like everything that I've learned, or like all the things we've learned, you know, about trailers and stuff, mm. if we can say we've learned anything, I, it's, obviously these things are really hard uh, without showing a thousand people your trailer and then asking them, mm. um, is that as soon as you run out of new things to show, stop the trailer. Mm. And at some point, it's a it's a it's a shooty game <laughs> like you you're you you know and it's and it's okay and maybe like trailer should be 20 seconds mm -hmm. you know i don't know um but like do, do you not think we've got a minute out of it i feel like we got a minute out of it. yeah we did but like do we show new things throughout that minute mm, fair point <clears throat> i don't know um Still can't believe that super farm worked. Super farm! How could you ever doubt it? What I don't understand is how those that super farm is growing when there's no water up there. <laughs> um. Well, I mean, it's just like how whales like ships a load of water to uh, to England all the time, right? Mm -hmm. It's the aqueducts. Yeah. I mean, you can't see them, but they're there. I was very close right, to okay, buying. Okay, now this the, this, uh, this seems three hundred to me. Like the fact that that's but, but, three objectives, but like mm -hmm. Dave Soft said, don't put them close together. But I don't see how I can not at least connect them because I just never going to get that many trees anywhere else. I don't know. Like I don't like. Are we like? And here's another one. Like here's another yeah. one. Right? Like here's a super farm. And I can't put it anywhere else. I actually literally have to put it next to it. So well, let's see. Let's see if we're making the mm. same mistake again. That actually won't well, go out. Okay. Five tiles like oh. But then I suppose part of it is like You have to sacrifice some objectives as well, maybe? It's like not trying to do everything. Yeah, it could be. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, do it doesn't feel like I have load. Like, I've got a lot of water ones just, like, chilling over here. But it doesn't feel like I'm really having to sacrifice too mm -hmm. many. I do find the tree one interesting because, like, the 
it's almost suggesting you, like I know you, like you can't count how many trees are <laughs> on no, those tiles, you know. I will not be counting. Yeah. Mm. I wonder if you can join up that seven in the other direction. Well, that way? Which seven? Like, as in, when I mean come from the six up to the seven that way, does that, would that screw it up? I don't know. <clears throat> yeah. Just have. Nice. Now you're thinking with hexagons. Mmm. <laughs> Having the kind of Tetris... Yeah, pocketing a tile, Dave's off saying. That would be interesting. But then I think... So, so that's where, like, how... Like, they could have done some, like, pocketing a tile... They could have found it so you have three tiles and you pick from those three every time. Mm. But then it moves further away from that meditative experience. Yes. Because you're always just thinking, where do I put this tile? You have one choice. You only have one choice. Um, oh, there's a hexagon at the top of the challenge thingy. What's it? Off in the Ooh, distance okay, the top. There is, yeah, true. All right. Okay, we'll head out that way then. I don't have a lot of tiles left, Sean. I think this no, might be No, but you're doing quite well. Ooh. But you, I think you might have that objective. There's a house objective down south you could get with those yeah. tiles. Yeah, true. No, the, the 16 you can get. 16, yeah, you yeah, can. Yeah. If you... It looks like sure. that's my best bet, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Because you've got three tile, three house I, tiles. I think we might be short. Sure. Oh, it's gonna be close. It's no. gonna be. It's gonna be. It's gonna be a photo finish on. I think well, we're short. Is there anywhere else I can? I can't even reach over there. I think this might be it. But any yeah. flags? I know no it's flags. only one. No, no flags. No. Uh, okay, here we go. Might as well try. He left on it. Oh, there is another tile. Oh, Sean, Ooh. what's 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 going on? How is that an X? How, How is, is that, that going wrong? What did How I is do? That? No, what did no? Why did I put this here? I think it was my last tile. Can you do something crazy with like fields somewhere? Like join that mega field with another field? Mm, no. Oh dear, that's a shame. Yeah, I, I literally okay. don't know. Yeah. Try and do it anyway, see what happens. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, I thought he was going to do it. <laughs> nice try. Game over, no, try yeah. again. Nice. And that's it. Yeah. Like, right? Like, I mean, I say that's it. Like, these things Oh, are... you just clicked try it again. You didn't see it. What? What about your city? Would you not spend some time looking over your city and thinking, I've done oh, nothing remember when but... I placed that river? I've not, not done nothing but look at look at that city. Like I think everyone can go back through the VOD and see all the mistakes I made, the ugly bits, the beautiful bits. Uh, mm -hmm. No, you got to move on, Sean. You got to move on to the next failure. Um, mm -hmm. So now I have slightly different things going on up here, including the villager one, which I had. Yeah, I unlocked. Mm -hmm. I think this last time. So. Oh, so that's random. I think so. I think are you not that's dealt not just three? the one you're kind of working on at the moment. I don't know. I don't know. I assumed you were kind of dealt because they changed between I noticed they changed between um playthroughs kind of thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so. so should I just like mince along with this for a little bit? A bit more? Yeah, I, I'm I'm I like I like I'm happy, you know, whatever you want to do. I mean like I wouldn't have placed that tile there, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> Like, like you, you could really? have seen there was the house coming up after there, and and you kind of blocked that house there. But you know, yeah. If we're gonna go with it, yeah, yeah, exactly. Chillax, meditative, meditative, yeah, and exactly. So, um, how are things with you, Dave? What have you been up to? Things are all good. Um, mm. 
What have I been up to? Uh, well, work, obviously. Um, mm -hmm. I've been up to writing. Uh, mm -hmm. Trying to do some writing. Um, so that's... that's what, what are you working on at the moment? You've got two books on the game? Uh, yeah. And it's, a game? Yeah. So, um, book-wise, uh, I've got a book coming out in uh, next May. So I've got mm -hmm. to do the structural edits on that. That's what I'm doing right now. Um, and I also have books coming out as part of the partnership that I write under, mm -hmm. which is DK Fields. And they've we've got a book coming out. Wow, we've got two really in quick succession. We've got one coming out in paperback for the first time in mm -hmm. June. You're testing me now. One yeah. coming out in hardback for the first time in August. So it's going to be a busy summer of mm -hmm. like book releases, but they're all like mm -hmm. done and dusted. Yeah. Um, they just need, um, you know, marketing and stuff, right? Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, so lo lots going on book wise. Sure, lots lots yeah. going on book wise. Um, cool. But all, all good, all good things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, also uh, writing more for making it home as well, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, lots going on there uh, as we finish that, that up. So you're going to go for a different tactic this time, or are you going to go, still go? I mean, I suppose by three? having a tactic, that would be that would <laughs> be a difference, right? Like yeah. that would be a difference. Different yeah, I don't know if I want. Like, do you do you, do you want to think about this game in that way? Like, like what I'm going to try and do, and I don't know if I feel if it seems like I've done it at all here or not, but uh, I am going to try and uh, maybe. What should I say? I have my objectives further away. I'm going to try that. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think that's a that's a fair comment and a, an interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Reach instead of loop. Yeah. Is the yeah. Yeah. Cool. I wonder if that is more efficient somehow. I mean, I just have a blanket assumption that anything I'm doing is the least efficient way to do something. Mm -hmm. So. I would love to have the kind of, I guess, like discipline to make a game like this. Why do you think? As in, mean? as it like, and the reason I think it needs discipline is because, or a game that is, is, uh, I don't know how to describe it as, I guess, elegant mm. would be a word to describe it. Whereas I find like, I tend to be drawn to more like, uh, like we kind of have did with making it home almost drawn to more uh like ran not random but like physics-y i don't know how to describe it but looser things right mm. like do you know what i'm trying to say not okay. really uh, <laughs> well, but like, that's okay so, but like so with making it home we had you know the original idea was to have almost like a more like we thought about it as like a card game yeah and it was this this idea of resource management and stuff. And then as we were developing it, we were like, oh, wouldn't it be cool if you're running around the vehicle and the way you were running around the vehicle changed how things work? Mm. So then it was looser, right? It's something that is hard to just kind of, this tile is better than this tile. Yes. You know? Yeah, true, true, true. Um, I see what you mean. Yeah. Whereas this is a game where it's this it is like a board game. You know, it's got that kind of board game. I don't know elegance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. That, no, Dave Soft has got it right. He, you've nailed it there. It's the idea of like deep simulations, like so. Or the that that it's about. And I guess that's like naturally, I'm drawn to simulations, right? Yeah. I'll always, given the choice, like my natural inclination is always to make a simulation of something, mm -hmm. you know, and then usually gets to the point where it's like, well, that simulation isn't necessarily fun, or it's like that simulation is just too like balancing that's impossible. Mm -hmm. And then I move away from it, <laughs> maybe. But I don't know. Yeah, like, but it's a different feel. It's not like worse or anything. I just there's something quite, I don't know, 
like I suppose you always when you're thinking about new projects like you think about that kind of stuff right yeah for sure for sure um and do you think do you think these games are a bit easier to like um <clears throat> or harder to like guard against uh, feature creep and things like that well because you wonder that's that's where uh whew. I wouldn't want to say that mm. it's easier, but it it feels like they did a good job of not feature creeping this. Mm. Like, like, but who the hell knows? Like, that's not how they might see it, right? Um, also fair, yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, it, it, is it feature? Yeah, possibly feature creep is is an, it's it's like sticking to a very core mechanic. There's a really you can just this game is really easily defined, right? Like mm -hmm. or or it's very I don't know, it's 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 recognizable, it's very yeah, it's yeah, like Dave's was clean, minimalistic, like it's just it's nice, it's good. Not saying that we don't make good stuff, but just, you know. <laughs> I would love to make a game of, of this ilk um, mm -hmm. sometime. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I also flag. think it will, it will, like, it would help. Uh, yeah, I think it would really help us as a, as like a development team to have, to 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 take an approach like this, and it would mm -hmm. like maybe lean into some of our constraints as well. Yeah, mm -hmm. like like mm -hmm. like the artwork for this game and the animation is lovely, but it is it's not something that would be totally beyond, you know, what we can produce in house. Mm -hmm. Or, you know yeah. the, the kind of thing that we might be able to produce mm -hmm. um, with a small team basically yeah mm -hmm. yeah i keep thinking about game jams as a thing to try and do or, or like as, as a way to kind of just prototype stuff mm-hmm Three D is hard to do for sure. Um, but it's like it's a number of it's a number of assets that's almost achievable in terms of paying someone to do it. Go wise at a thought. I, don't know. I mean it, that I mean that does just depend hugely on the game and yeah. the scope, isn't mm -hmm. it? That's the question. Mm -hmm. Um, so I downloaded that crazy game, the um, crazy. Into the Depths or From the Depths or From the Deep or... I don't know what you're talking Gold. about. Uh, I mentioned it a few weeks ago. Um, from the Depths. It's a vehicle building game. Oh, okay, cool. Like a crazy... Like talking of crazy simulation games, mm. it's like the thing that makes... A siege and even Kerbal Space Program look pretty easy. <laughs> um, I started the tutorial and I, I've 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 played like several hours of the tutorial, but boy, like it's a thing. It's it's just yeah, it really <laughs> is. You can tell it's like a labor of love. Like the um, the tutorial is voice acted by who I'm presuming is the developer. <clears throat> wow. Okay. Yeah. And the thing that I love the most about it is that um, there, there, there are several instructions that are repeated mm -hmm. and it's the same voice sample. So nice. it's just this guy saying, it, you would just hear the same guy in, in the same voice saying, place the block onto the marker. Place the block onto the marker. Huh? Over and over and over. Nice. What I mean, um, I'm don't keep me uh, in suspense. Did you did you manage to place the box onto the marker? I did, um, I did. But like, it was one of these tutorials where, um, like I'd figured it out, and I was like, it taught you. So like in like tutorial one C, it teaches you like the symmetry tools, so yeah. you can build blocks on two sides, mm -hmm. and then in tutorial two D, you have to like build. So you have to build. So, oh man, it's 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 bananas. I I, I kind of want to bring it to a stream, but it's a little bit scary, and I, I probably should 
spend some more time with it mm-hmm. um, before I do. But you have to. So th- I think the idea is you're building these vehicles and these ships and stuff, and they've got guns on. You have to build AIs for the guns, mm-hmm. and you build them like you build cards, like you build a computer. Mm-hmm. Like so, you have like an AI chip, and then you have to connect an AI chip to a targeting computer, and then a targeting computer to something else to a scanner to search for targets and so on. So anyway, so in one of the early tutorials, they showed you how you use a symmetry plane. You can build things on either side symmetrically. And then in this other tutorial where they're teaching you about target acquisition and all this stuff, they want you to build symmetrical things, but they tell you to do it step by step. So it was just kind of getting annoyed with me that I was using the symmetry tools. And so it was just telling me like that I was doing it wrong the whole time. Oh. And it was that same... Forty Nice. Oh, and it got to the point where it was driving me a little bit crazy. Um, so I think I might just t- make another look. Yeah, making tutorials is is really hard though. Like, yeah, it, just so hard. Um, it, it's more of a particular. skill than people give it credit for. Yeah, I mean, we we I mean, well, like we often. If we have any sort of idea, the first thing one of I think feel like the whoever's idea it ain't <laughs> will say, "How do you tutorialize that?" <laughs> and that, that's, that's true. always like a test, yeah, of whether or not it goes in. Um, which is not a bad test. Like I think no, it's a it's, good way of thinking. I think yeah. it's like, yeah. And sometimes it can help really kind of like solidify the idea for the person. It's like, yeah, actually, you're right. Like that's something you haven't thought of or that would be a really mm. cool way of trying to do something mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Shit, I'm supposed to not be doing this okay, we're not- I think also the, the, the thing we learned very early on and like I, I see people do this now like um you notice is, is do it. I notice people doing it yeah. is um trying to both you do tutorial and story okay mm-hmm. and I think it was something you when you joined you, you kind of said is like well yeah that's it's probably because like with intelligent design one of the key feedbacks was like people were like what the hell did you do mm-hmm. um and and you kind of noticed that it was because I was trying to tell a story and teach them how to play the game at the same time and that's asking a lot from a piece of writing. Yeah. You know. It's also asking a lot for the person like who's reading it. Yeah. And they're like, well, like what I really mm-hmm. need here is just to know what to do. I don't yeah. I don't really actually need loads of things that can detra- distract from that. It, it's one of those things that AAA studios can do it because they've got so much focus tester. Like they've got so many testers that they can make it work like and they can test it and they can they they know what they're doing and so i think without those massive teams it's really hard to do that yeah and uh, but also like cin- cinematics right like like i think being able mm-hmm. to have a cinematic that you then interrupt with some like a quick time event like yeah even then well, you've like, got loads of hexagons off in the distance i i i, I, I have two yes and we're working towards this one Is that the train station one, isn't it? Yeah. So actually, I think I probably want it here. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, I, I, I do find it impressive, like, when you, you play a game like Half-Life and somehow you know where to go. <laughs> yeah. And, like, there's no reason other than, like, very clever lighting. Um, that they've focused test and I need to look at the analytics for making a home. I haven't looked in a while. It kind of we used it a lot to start with to kind of get a basic feel, but then like 
I think there's an issue with like the people who are playing at the moment are really good at the game. <laughs> so if we balanced the game based on them, it would be like bad idea. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Mm. But yeah, into the depths looks really cool, but just like the time investment is scary to really learn it. It, it mm. does feel like at some point it feels like, Hey, I'm actually programming and like, I'm actually there's like, bo oh, like buoyancy is modeled correctly and stuff. You know, you have to put like, you have to know how to make boats. That, I mean, that sounds like so much your jam though. Like, like, well, yeah, yeah. Like, and so I suppose this is the way the, the fix is like when I started playing Kerbal space program, I had a basic understanding of orb orbital mechanics, but not like, a huge amount mm -hmm. and and then i learned it through mm -hmm. playing and like could i could i learn could i learn like how to make boats <laughs> i, I believe know. you could learn how to make boats mm -hmm. like, I think but do i want to like do, that's do i want to spend that time doing mm -hmm. it do, would i feel i would you know i feel like that effort could be put into creating something or i don't know but well, if you're going to enjoy doing it, then it's... Then yeah, it's, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It just cancels that time, doesn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Boater dynamics. Yeah, I don't know. What, what is it called? What 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 is... What's the... Hydro... What, what do you call the people who make boats? Anybody? Uh, shipwrights, is it? Shipwrights. What do you call people that make boats? Boat rides? Ship shipwrights. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. See? And people say Someone like a humanities or... degree is worthless. Oh hang on, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. That's not actually what I wanted to know. Okay. What do you call people who design boats? Ah. That's... Shipbuilders. No, that can't be right. It's on Wikipedia though. <laughs> so it must be right yeah um shipbuilding ship repairs both commercial and military are referred to as naval engineering naval, okay. naval, naval. naval engineering okay. cool. yeah Right, I'm going to get to one of these hexagons and then maybe call it quits. Okay. The evening, dude, because I'm aware of time. See what it is? On. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I would love to make it again. I would love to make a game like Dwarf Fortress with all this kind of crazy simulation, but it's the opposite of the thing I said earlier. <laughs> yes, it is. It is definitely. So you cannot do it. Like we, yeah. we need mm -hmm. to stop you from doing that. We need to save you from yourself. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that. Nailed that. Mm. Cool. So there's a 25 mega uh -huh. um, going in there. So this is Dwarf Romantic, which may or may not have anything to do with romantic dwarfs. We never found out. No, we can find. Uh, let me find the store page because I think it's a lovely, lovely game. Yeah. But, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's, it's lovely. It's, it's, it's nice and chilled. Yeah. And, but there's, as you've seen here, there's a lot of depth. Mm -hmm. Um, and like a lot of great board games, you can just like the more you play with it, the more you develop an understanding of how things are working. Uh, you mm -hmm. just want to come back to it and go, you know, and do it just a little bit better next time. Oh man. Kind of look at some of the, on the store page, look at these. Wow. Like, People that actually know what they're doing. Geek. <laughs> like, wow. Easy Tiger. Better. All right. All right. Yeah. But yeah, that no, I guess. No, not that, you, like both of us, but yeah, God. I guess that does mean, like, I get, like, it, it lends itself to a situation where you can just keep going, right? Like, that's how you rack up these. Like, we've often yeah. said, like, I mean, the game does have a fail state, right? Like, you run out of time. There's a creative mode without a fail state. Okay. Well, they, yeah, that's cool. So it does have that. Yeah. So maybe that's what they were doing. Maybe. But, like, yeah. It, with with that even with that in mind presumably there comes a point well i don't know maybe you can go on and on and on forever if you are just that good at dwarf 
romantic. Um, mm-hmm. But maybe, maybe there's some kind of the numbers just get so much, and the number of tiles you have becomes fewer and yeah. fewer. Mm-hmm. It's, it's impossible to keep going forever and ever. Mm-hmm. But yeah, it's kind of got that uh, that vibe of a I, I understand more, and I, w- I want to try different, you know styles of building out and all that kind of approaches different things so i think there's a good degree of replayability here but also Mm -hmm. it's just like a game you could just whack on and chill out you know and just not yeah it it really helped me through the weekend like it just yeah yeah, it's zone out have fun kind of oh this would be a great oh man this is like like get a tablet the steam app on a tablet play this on a tablet that's very on the true. Couch. Yeah. 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 Very true. Awesome. Thanks, Dave. Cool, That's great. I, I was going to bring it next week. So, so <laughs> like, yeah, no, beat it to it. Beat, beat me. That doesn't yeah. happen very often. That doesn't uh-huh. happen very often. But yeah. Uh, so, Sean, where can people find out about us? Uh, they can find us at pillbug.zone. Please, please click the happy internet buttons wherever you happen to be watching this. And we will see you next week. See you next week, everyone. Have a good week. <laughs>